got you something too. Okay. <laughs> it's a black heart. Oh my god. Because you'll always have my heart, Chloe. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, let me put it on. It's about a friendship between two girls and two girls that are, are really close um, and uh, they're kind of living their own lives, they've got their own freedoms and kind of with those freedoms come all the, the tragedy with, you know, just doing whatever the hell you want to do and, um, and being young you get yourself into really stupid situations and their lives start escalating into one problem after the next and kind of coupled with the, you know, doing a lot of drugs. I think that's why most people feel that the film's kind of emotionally moving is because everybody recognizes their mistakes in it. The subtext of the film has always been the sick are just so pure and you know like people with problems which basically means everybody and everybody that doesn't choose to that chooses not to ignore their problems, you know, that deals with them head on. You know, there's there's beauty and tragedy and I think that's what I just want to show in the film, you know, because the low people sidestep that everybody's trying to get out of the gutter you know and maybe some people just enjoy living in it i think it's just a, a, a decision in my own head the whole time you know i like both sides of life i don't know which one to lead it i i was a a, a dancer and a journalist mostly music journalism and worked in the music industry and uh, doing choreographic pieces and i just started using uh, video a lot more and the video side like the cinematic aspect came into it a whole lot more so I decided well it was kind of preordained I guess that I got into film just encapsulated all the different art forms and genres and um, and it's the best way to tell stories really I just enjoyed working with a film script like the outline of a film script you know it's 90 pages bang there's a lot of white space I think it just suited my attitude and the way I like working, which is a little bit off the cuff. Calculated, but off the cuff. It's trying to see how far, I suppose, an audience can go in looking at something and how much they get emotionally engaged in it and why they get engaged in it. So I think the, the closer you can make it feel real without pretending it's real, um, it's, just, it's just an interesting concept for now.